Hey guys, it's your lit auntie and I like hair will be sponsoring the beginning of this vlog. They sent over this beautiful natural kinky edge wig. No slicking, no gel, no any of that. It mimics African American hair so well. Um, I love the texture of the hair. I love the hairline. You don't have to do too much, you know. It just really resembles our hair. The hairline is just bum. So what I'm going to do is just hop straight into the packaging for you guys. It came in this orange bag right here to store it in. You don't get a box, but this is what you get. Let me show you everything that was in there. You will get the wig, a card with instructions on it, a rat tail comb, a wig cap, and you will get a bag that has edge brush and edge brush. A bling clip and other clips to tie your hair back while you're styling it. This is a strap to make the wig glueless and let's get into the construction of the wig. There is a comb at the back with an adjustable strap. There are three combs throughout the wig, two on the side and one in the front. This is a lace front wig and it has this beautiful kinky texture that I absolutely love. So let's get more into the hairline that is the highlight focus of this wig. It is beautiful. Look at this right here. No bleaching or anything. It just gives this natural kinky baby hair hairline you don't have to do too much This is something new, it's innovative. Let me zoom in real quick so you guys can see how it just looks like our hair, okay? So, I will make sure that I leave the link to this wig, a discount code, and all of that below. I absolutely love it, it's something different. At first I was like, can I make it work? It was a little work for me. You guys know I do not like to work when I have wigs, but I made it happen. So, don't forget to check out this company. They have quad pay, split pay options. They have different type of wigs um, and everything. I just decided to show you guys their newest style. So, let me know what you think down below in the description box. And thank you, I like hair, for sponsoring this portion of my vlog. Let's go. Hey y'all, what it do? We about to go pick flowers. I got on Chanel Chance. So, tender. I also put that in my hair. The hair mist. Excuse my lip shot. These glasses are from Linsmart. They're the kind that you can do like that. And y'all know these two-piece sets are from Shein. I showed you guys one that was blue, one that was yellow, one that was pink, and now I'm in the black one. Let's go. Y'all, look, there goes Skippy. You remember the dog? Look at the chickens. Look at your son. Okay, we here, y'all. Ain't nobody here. That's good. Let's go. 
All right, so I've been here before, but just in case you're new. Oh, there's not anything on the board. We can't well over here for nothing. Okay, well. Yeah, oh, yeah, I missed it. She went to feed the chickens. They took off running. Like me. Yeah, look at his eyes. Let's see. Sit. Boy, you ain't trained. Sit, I said. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. You're not trained. Let me see your eyes. Mm -hmm. Oh, hi. I don't have no water. You thirsty, though. You can get up there and get some water. I ain't in a lot. I'm scared. Let's try another one. They not in these, huh? It's like some been out here eating them. Bees. Yeah. Oh, it's bees in them. Yeah. That's what made me say that. Oh, one of each one is a thing. I think each one is a thing because he said some of them fan out. Hold on, no toys. Hold on, toys the end. It's like a few. Damn. They said, wait a minute. Uh -huh. Yeah, some done sit out here and ate the flowers, and you know, bees are attracted to sunflowers, so they like heavily invested. Hold on, babe. What about over there? Let's just go back where I said. I'm sorry. We having a hard time, but I don't care. Well, I am. I'm gonna get some flowers now. Now, now, all pumpkin or something. <laughs> Where we at? This way. Go! <laughs> you took a shortcut. You know your way around here? Okay. Ooh, yeah, I am traumatized, right, baby? Yeah. Boy, how I was swinging at them bees. Show them, poo-poo. <laughs> oh. All right, guys, we out here, so I came to check on my son. The car goes saying, of course, she is horrible with cemeteries and stuff. So, yep, they cleaned up, y'all. And did. All right, just making sure they did. I don't even gotta go check my mama because hers wasn't bad, remember the last time. So, yep, all right. All right, play breast. We got them on together. It's cleaned up. It's mowed, right, Nicole? Mm -hmm. Everything looking great. Cause uh, who don't play? Talking about they couldn't keep a uh, lawn service. All these people need a job, and this ain't no big cemetery, huh? Like y'all could, my lawn dude would have ate this up in what an hour? <laughs> Maybe two. Maybe two, yeah. Cause it's stretched far back there. Oh, somebody out here now. So, all right, my camera's blinking, so. I'm going to shower, y'all, because I done got, I think I got stung by a bee. You see right here? <sighs> here my little sunflowers, honey. They was $2 a stem, so it was on, I got five of them, so it was only $10. <sighs> Set them right here, honey. All right, guys, so I was going to do this on my floor, but I don't want to mess my carpet up. So keep individually sell, mystery sell, like group it. This is giving me high grade anxiety, guys. But we're about to do it. Um, <laughs> um, let's just start. So, like stuff like this, brand new. I remember getting this in New York at Sephora. Brand spring, spanking new, a hundred dollar palette. I ain't never used it ever. Gosh, talk about high grade anxiety. I ain't did nothing but these two rows, y'all. This is the sale pal. This is the sale pal. This is the mystery pal. Look at all those MAC lipsticks. This is all I'm gonna keep. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's just making me so sad. And then this is what I'm back into MAC because they're old and molded. Yeah, I ain't lying when I say this shit here about to send me because that's only. This part right here, I still got to clean out both towers. Both. 
Oh, and I have makeup over here too. I do. All right, so I've set these back up here and that right there. And so I'm gonna try to only have these right here and one tower of makeup I keep, all right? All right, yeah, I put this right here just for now to clear this bag to put some more stuff I'm gonna sell in. I think I'm gonna quit for it tonight because high grade anxiety. I did clean this one out. This one is cleaned out as well. I just got other stuff in here right now. And then look, it's just like so much stuff, y'all. I'm tapping out. I've done all I can today. Um, I got this t this one because it's two separate ones down to this drawer. Done. All right, guys, really quick, I made somebody some perfume samples. I even labeled it for them and put some samples in from when I went to Louis Vuitton the other day. Um, real quick, I went ahead and put the makeup on my website, so it is going to be mystery bundles. How I decided to do it was small, medium, and large, so I will link them below. They will already be on there, and I will already announce it on social media by the time this vlog hits, so I don't know if I will still have any. Uh, but it's a lot of makeup, so I'm quite sure I will. With all the details, please read the details before purchasing. Guys, this is decluttered makeup. It's swatched. Some of it is old. Some of it is collector's items. Some of it is new. Some of it is um, drugstore. Some of it is high-end designer. It's a mystery box. I don't know your shade. When I saw mystery boxes on Poshmark, people was like, she sent me a highlight of this for white people. And I'm like, how the hell am I supposed to know who you are? Shit, like I was supposed to say, okay, well, I think her, by her name, she black. Let me put, it's a mystery box. You got to take your chances, guys. So, I do have three sizes. By the way, it's very blurry. Let me my glasses. By the way, you guys know that blood and bob I always wear all the time. Okay, so she sent me this week, too. It's a baseball cap. You just throw it on, honey. Okay, yep, it's a cap. Y'all, another dog just scared me coming out the house. I don't know what's up with it. But, um, I love this dog. I mean, <laughs> this bag, but it's more like spend a night, come over type. So, I'm going to go and get the medium. I mean, the small one. So, it can be more compact. Because I'm just weighing this down chunk and stuff in here. But, I'm going to keep this one because I love it. But, this is for, like, me and babe finna go spend a night at a staycation or something. I just need to put a few things in here. There is a small version. I will link both below and I will link this wig below. Yeah, I be thinking I'm tripping, reaching over here like, where is my stuff? Not knowing this purse got a pocket on both sides. Lord. Okay, so I'm at Fruit of Loco. You guys not coming all the time when I want some good food. I hope it's good today. I hope I don't waste my motherfucking money. Uh, ugh. Because ain't nothing like some bad fruit. Bitter, unsweet fruit. But let's go. <laughs> Can I have a little sweet cream? Waiting on my tacos, y'all. Came to get fruit. Y'all see how I don't act right? But y'all know she go eat them. I just want to taste them. I forgot to show y'all. She added what you asked sugar? And I told you I have green sauce. It's just meat and cheese on her. I gave her the rest. She like them. You really like them or you just like them? You'll get them again? Swinging and banging. Y'all, I don't know if it is. I got to cover that light. So it don't. I don't know if it is the cleaning or the mouthwash or whatever they got me on. But it has... The worst taste ever in my mouth that's like driving me crazy. I'm like brushing my teeth like every fucking hour because I cannot stand this taste in my mouth. I came up here to get boxes though to ship the makeup sale stuff off in. I need cards. So I only have to go to one post office. This will be the... Oh, yeah, I be so tongue-tied. That is brain fog. I hate this shit ever since I had COVID. 
anyway we're gonna keep it pushing like we always do i came to one post office i thought i was gonna have to make multiple rounds but i got this many small flat rate i got some more of the medium flat rates i like and i got some large flat rate boxes so this should get me through the orders today and tomorrow so yeah i didn't show y'all my back to neck bag i'm not gonna empty it it's pretty crucial a lot of lipsticks and stuff in here okay let's pack a large flat rate box with me so you guys can kind of get the gist of this i'm gonna put a layer of bubble wrap in the bottom i'm using the thin bubble wrap because if i use a thick one y'all are gonna say she filled the box of bubble wrap so yeah Right, guys so i actually went ahead and packed two large boxes since i'm already out here um under here it's just pallets on top of pallets and etc i don't want to move it around because it's a lot stuffing this stuff in here like this so y'all get the point all right now let's see what we got she's empty she's empty <laughs> i'm keeping those sorry i ain't giving away my nars She's empty. Mm. Oh my gosh. I'm so proud of myself because I really got high grade anxiety. I really don't want these, but they're kind of like beat up. So I didn't want to put those in the boxes. Still need to clear this out. These three. Still need to clear them three out. All right. Over here, it's a little. This top one's empty. Um, All of this is trash this is like well this is like beauty supply store. oh i guess it's not i was gonna say it's like beauty supply store stuff i'm not gonna put in those boxes so i'm gonna trash that but we have to empty out the trash first so it's not so heavy same with this drawer i, mm, I might go through and pick out like my black radiance blushes because i really really love them but a lot of this is trash I just need my trash empty first because it's already heavy from throwing a lot of stuff away. Keeping this. Keeping all these. Oh, <laughs> y'all know. <laughs> y'all know this been broken, but it's empty. This one empty. This one is empty. And I'm keeping. Oh, no, I'm not keeping this, honey. Let's go put these in some boxes. Yeah, I'm so freaking goofy because, yeah, but your girl did it. I did it. All right, guys, we've done some adjusting, but this is what y'all need to see over here, honey. This is all I kept. I tried to make it look neat. This, are, I'm lying. This ain't all I kept. I'm going to show y'all real quick. Um... This, sorry, these drawers are like doing the most. It's the next day, by the way, if I ain't already been on here today. I'm able to like space out and see what I got. And this is all that I kept. This is the last drawer. I want to say, hold on, it might not be. Yeah, this is it. Like, and then over here. This is where like my sunglasses, my designer sunglasses, the cases go right there. Here as well. This is um, wallets. And this is nothing. I'm going to put my bandos over here too. This is side my titty tape, y'all. I'm going to put my bandos right here. So I can start wearing them. If I see them, I'll wear them. So we're eating in tonight, guys. I was trying to get out, but they said let's try this place i got a turkey burger of course let me see if i can show it to y'all turkey 
turkey, burger, egg, pepper jack. Yummy. Okay. So, what's this thing doing? So, <clears throat> somebody, y'all know. <laughs> See, I'm gonna cry. Just got like a major collaboration. <laughs> um, what's the word? Uh, I don't know, cause it's really not a collaboration because it kind of that's what it say. But it's I get collaborations all the time. Well, this is like a what? This is um. Major. It's yeah, it's a big deal. So <laughs> she don't want to be on chemicals. <laughs> so I guess that's coming soon, so <laughs> wait on that. Wait for it. Okay. <laughs> Good morning everyone. We have an Amazon package. I am excited to show you this. If you guys follow Julie on TikTok, excuse the missing nails. It's been a long weekend. You see all that makeup I had to clean and pack through? And my beauty room is looking good. I'm going to show you the, the, the changes I did. But if you follow her, she went. she's a viral TikTok sensation. Like millions and millions of followers and views. She posted this about press-ons. Oh, great. Bubble wrap. After I just went and bought a whole bunch of extra yesterday. Right, and it is for your press ons. I bought a pair of used press ons. You guys have still been asking me about these. Like I say all the time, I cannot link them here because I get them from someone who sells replicas. I repeat, I cannot link my press ons because I get them from someone who sells replicas. If you want the information, hit me outside of YouTube. Do what you want with that information. Okay, so. Don't you just love Amazon? I have an idea for an Amazon video, but I'm gonna keep it to myself till I do it. Y'all know how they go, influencer world. And um, yeah, they've just been coming through for me the last two years. Well, I've been an Amazon head. Like me and my best friend Joe, when I used to work, I used to be at um my desk. I used to be at my desk, ordering stuff from Amazon all the time before it was before YouTube days. So, like phone cases and stuff like that. It looks a little off, how are those to say? Okay, all right, first of all, let's do this right. There's a film on here. And this. <laughs> let's start there. And the film is on both sides, so you're going to have a nice, clean acrylic look when you take it off of both sides compared to, oh my gosh, this. Okay, guys, next up, which is a difficult task. They should have had, like, little tab things. You have to sit here. I'm watching the video. You have to sit here and pick all of these off of here. Let me get in frame. This, not me. And so I'm having to use my box cutter. Like what? It's a hassle. It really is a hassle. So I'm just gonna do all of these. And after you do that, it's just like magnetized to this like this. Uh-oh. Oh yeah. I think. Shoot. Like this, okay? All right, y'all. So I have to watch a video because this is gonna take a long time. So I'm watching Rochelle. Let me pause her. So I got one whole tray with the things on there. So let's scoop this back and let's open this up. What you do with that? God damn, I gotta cut this myself too? Damn, God damn, God damn. Okay, so you put a strip. Oh, y'all can't even see me. You put a strip of this on here, right? Like so, like that. In the words of Tabitha. I don't have no scissors, so we're gonna use the handy dandy box cutter that you guys named. All right, guys, so these scissors are from Amazon as well. I absolutely love them, but they are super duper sharp, honey. I mean sharp. I done cut my uh, hand before. So then you just remove the other end of the tape. It's just double-sided tape, guys. Yeah, see, this gonna take me 12 years, honey. Glad I ain't got that many press-ons. You snap it back on her. 
See, y'all told y'all this was gonna take 40 days and 40 nights. I done transitioned to watching Gina now. And I took my press-ons off because I'm finna, one was missing anyway, and I'm finna put a new set on. So this is all I'm gonna show, honey, because this is tedious. I'm gonna do these as they come, because I was finna sit and peel all these off. No, ma'am. And you just slide it, slide it. Off in there. Oops, I did that too rough. Let's start over. Huh, leave it to me. God, damn. Nah. That is too cute though. Oh my gosh. All right guys, so this is what we going with for now. And as I take my other custom ones off, I add them. But this is too tedious for me to sit here and do today. A lie. So let me update y'all on these drawers if I haven't. I just cut this part out. I did, I did. I did not show you guys what I did with these though. So I put my purple wallets in here. Sorry, I put my purple wallets in here. Uh, these are our like bucket hats. This, oh, that's titty tape. Baseball caps are in there, but <laughs> it's broke. So that's why I put them right there. It makes it long. I need to clean these drawers off. Here are my stretch belts. And then down here is all of my uh, bandos. I had to pull this stuff out the boxes so I can start wearing it. Like, I got this one last year for my birthday, and I ain't even wore it. My birthday's in a week and a half. Yeah, sad. And this one is just like Louis Vuitton boxes and stuff. Boy, I owe so many of y'all apology because of my last vlog. I was quoting what young uh, thug daughter was saying walking home from school. And I was like, where did that come from? And so, Nicole got home. And I was like, in the comments, everybody keeps saying Cat Williams or what, Friday after next? Mm -hmm. And Nicole was like, they did say that in there. So that little girl real bad. Because <laughs> she got that from that movie. I didn't even know. So y'all are right, technically. That's not where I got it from. But y'all are right. This right here. Look at your son. 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 <laughs> yeah, I was right, honey. So I'm about to put on some Shein press ons. I'm putting this set on right here. They were $1.99 and they are thick. Y'all know I'll be worried about if they thick or not. So I'm putting on this little melanin set right here. Alright, guys, this is what we got right here. They are a little too long for my liking. Let it focus. So I am gonna cut them down. Because with press on nails, I like them to be a little shorter than what I would typically wear them. Because if they knock up against something, it's more of a chance of them coming off. My bag is so cute right here. It's too cute. Oh, that's a beautiful color. But yeah, let me cut them down. But this is them. They thick. $2 she in, honey. Hey, y'all. It's another day. I just finished this hair review. Y'all, look at the edges. Oh, will it focus? Oh, y'all will see it at the beginning of the video. So let me get this on the roll before the kids get her making a lot of noise. All right, guys. I got some new stuff to show you guys. I'm excited to try. I hope it work out. The company is Nidor or Nidor. I'm going to say Nidor, okay? So they sent over some strapless adhesive type bras, three different types. This is one of the boxes right here. And I'm super excited to try these. I have the perfect dress to try this with all right guys so i came in here so you can have a better view this is the guy sitting in my regular bra so what i'm going to do is take the bra off and show you guys how this dress look without the bra oh. all right so this is me without the bra it makes a big difference <laughs> things almost went to the ground okay so the first bra we will be trying on is called the silicone strapless bra let me see if the size is on here. This is size G. You guys know usually I am an H cup, but when I want to sit up, I go down a size. So this tell you right here that they have extended sizes. It's one of these bras right here that have the snap in the middle. So we're gonna just put it and then make it bring it like this. But due to the nature of YouTube demonetizing everything sexually explicit, I can't like even hold them and show you guys on camera. So I'm gonna put it on 
and I'll be right back. So there are nipple covers in here as well and these come in a variety of colors. This usually isn't the color that I would keep but I wanted to this isn't the color that I would usually pick, but I wanted to try this so bad, and I think they were out of my brown shade, so I got it anyway. Oh my gosh, would you look at that? You can't even see it. I do, I'm do. i gonna show you guys. I'm, I'm trying not to get demonetized. It's on right here, okay? So, it just pulled them all together and gave me that natural little lift. Girl, let's test it out. <laughs> and what I did do, I had to take it off, put it back on, take it off, put it back on. And what I really love is the fact that you take it off, you just wipe it off, and it still sticks. Um, you do, you hand wash it, you peel it off gently, of course. Do not iron this. Why would you iron it? Do not dry clean, okay? Um, yeah, so let's move on to the next one. We're back sagging. So the next one is the fabric strapless bra. It's just like the one I just showed you, except it's not silicone. Please remember that I will leave the link below. This is what it looked like right here. It's the exact same thing, except it's fabric. This one is an F cup. It's even smaller. Do not wear these for more than six hours or if you have allergic skin or nursing. We have a pretty good hole, but do not size down in these. It's it's barely on her, y'all. So get your size, but it's still holding them up. But please get your size. This is an F, the other one was a G. I really need a H, but it's still getting a job done. So let's try the tape. So you guys know I have an obsession with tape. I just wanna show you guys how it will come. This is the color I got, let's put it on. So this gives off a whole different type of vibe. It don't give the, I probably could have done it like that, but I actually ran out. And this is the actual white. It's wider than most tape is. So, yeah. I'm gonna show, let me see if I can show you guys. I have it strapped going the long way like that. So you can customize that kind of tape however you need it. Sometimes you might need it to go this way. It actually makes my boobs look smaller, don't it? A little bit. So yeah, I will leave the link to all of these bras and a discount code below. Thank you, Night Order, for sponsoring this portion of my blog. I know it's dark, but we're about to attempt the good knees challenge. <laughs> this thing's too sticky. All right, let me put some on. What do you put on? What do, what do I put on? This is a high quality fashion boutique thingy. So, whoa, shit. Y'all didn't see that. Yeah, I'm laughing so hard, but I, I ain't gonna be able to keep this going. Because of the music, right? You really got to listen. Damn, I don't know. I just tripped over this rug, so I be on tripped and fail. I'm ready. You really got to listen. You got to listen. Two hands up and keep them up. You really got to listen. Where the Yeah, I barely made that, and it wasn't that my knees went out. It's that I just had to keep starting over, keep starting over, kept timing out. My screen kept going out. <sighs> By the time I got it, boy, I was tired. I, if I would have got it on the first round, I would have hit it. You hear me? Let's look at our knees in here. Okay, big senior, homecoming week. Look at Instagram. Let's go. Because I was laughing myself because I almost didn't make it because I had to do it 20 times. By the 20th time, I was tired. Why is the first thing that came up? <laughs> My baby room. Y'all don't look at it. Look at the screen. Don't look at it. Look at your son. Look at me. You gonna do it, sugar? You should do it with me. You think you grown? <laughs> Am I grown? Do you think you grown? Very much so. 42, big 42. Not the little one. Big Libra. <laughs> Sugar almost didn't make it, bro. Because over my 30th time, don't tell Frank his grandma and her cutting up. Oh, I'm gonna go show him. Yeah, I never made it back here in that one vlog. So it's gonna be a quick run in and out. Y'all yeah, already know what I'm coming in here to get. I don't know how I never made it back. Nice. I can use my camera. Ain't nothing going on up in here now. Oh, they moved it. 
are sold out. All right, guys, so I came on to Target. You see why I don't go out the house? Because I really went in there for one thing, but y'all know a sis love to smell good. Let's feel like I got some on my lip. I don't know what's going on. Hold on, y'all. Mm, no, nothing on my lip. So I saw Sharika B with this trench coat. Um... It was purple in his dress. It was purple. I'm going to run in here and see if we got it. Let me find out I'm turning into a Target girl. Well, I ain't really a nothing girl. I don't do Target while I'm an Amazon girl. So, um, look. I'll be back. Baby, this must be the ghetto Target because where y'all sign it? Is this Target or is this uh H-E-B or something? I don't know where I'm at. Let's just try our luck. Oh, okay. It's Target. Baby, I must wasn't paying attention because it didn't look like a grandma dress when I was looking at Sharika. Oh, here go both. Right here. Here's the blazer and the dress. Yeah, I'm too mad. They ain't got my size in either one. Go ahead. They ain't got my size in either one. So, I got real happy because I thought they had my size in a dress. I was going to get an extra large. Baby, baby, why I look real close and it was a smile on the extra large hanger? So I said, I'm gonna just have to um, order online, I guess. And then that coat, <clears throat> they only had extra smiles, but I'm like, am I gonna ever get to the point where I need a coat like that? It's just so cute. Baby, because as you can see, it's foul, and it was still 90 degrees today. Mid October. Yeah, that, that, God, it's not, my dog ate up this hair. That dress do give real cute. My booty gonna look big vibes. So I'm gonna order it online. All right, guys. I'm at this place called Fluffy's Chicken. All right. Put this in your memory. <laughs> because they got some good chicken and fish and stuff. And y'all need to try them, okay? So I'm not gonna take the camera here with me. Let's go. But let me tell you something. This is that good hood food. That salt on the mother freaking top gonna kill me. Oh my gosh. Poo Poo, they say you gonna get me when you got home and saw that video. I'm gonna see you. Exactly. <laughs> now let me see you with them knees. No, ma'am. <laughs> Why? Because you gonna pick me up. <laughs> <laughs> hey, just try. Just no, try, drop just no, real quick. We, got, we know regular walking one of these knees don't work right. <laughs> 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 We're not doing that. <laughs> Y'all screaming because y'all mean we went to Vegas. And we had no we was running down the stairs. Huh? We was evacuating our oh, room. I thought you were talking about in Miami too. Oh yeah. <laughs> These always give out. Baby, I didn't think Nicole was gonna make. I was like, just get on my back. I tell y'all about that all the time. If I find the clip, I'll put it in here. Then we was in Miami last year for our anniversary. We had to, we was walking from Borden G's because it was so close to our hotel. <laughs> I didn't think the car was going to make it. Me neither. So I was going to have to go see St. Peter. <sighs> My poor baby. Mm -mm. You ain't going to do none of that challenge. And they tell about some, somebody tell me about your thighs burning. What you got to say to that? Is your thighs burning? They ain't, huh? I'm yeah, perfectly no. fine. I'm doing that shit every day. Ah! <laughs> nothing i my knees don't bother me at all uh, i'm gonna show y'all what i got from victoria's secret it's also gonna be in my birthday haul said i wasn't gonna do one but you guys are sending me so much stuff um i'm gonna go ahead and do one plus i gotta go check my p.o box tomorrow um
I have to check my PO box tomorrow because a lot of you got, yeah, my bra's not too little, I promise you. It's been a long day. A lot of you guys have sent me stuff and you're like, it's there, it's there, it's there. Fun fact, I only check my PO box once a week and uh, that's kind of hard now too because it always reminds me of my son when I go back to my old neighborhood. So, I try to, sometimes I go longer than two a week depending on depending on if they text me and say my box is full. I love how they spray your tissue paper. So, you guys can guess what I got. I mean, I showed you what I got. So, these are $6.99 today. And I was like, yeah. Hold on, babe. Here's a receipt for you to scan. I saw Bellini and I just knew they was going to have peach in them. So, it has island peach, iced hibiscus. Bring it back so I can put it in the bag in case I need to exchange. Here's the booze. Come on. Girl, shut up. This smells like it will be. Pe Whoa, that smell good. Smell um pear good with pesa soi. Oh my gosh, I might need to go back and get some more. There, why six ninety nine? Oh my gosh, that smells extremely good. No cap, no cap. I am not playing. So then. I also got what I went to get. Check. Was that two vlogs ago? Where's vlog? This, um, I'm super bright in them, y'all. Let's do that. That's too damn dark almost. Okay, the sugar floor. The, sh the tea sugar floor. And I got the, what they call their whipped body polish so let me see what it do for y'all now i link all this below in case you don't have a local oh gosh this smells like green apples oh that's not the consistency i thought it was gonna be they say it's even a scrub to this is this the scrub this is the scrub or is it? I don't like this. Why is crunchy? What's a whipped body polish? Babe, would you look on Victoria's Secret and see, or Google whipped body, body polish Victoria's Secret and see what it is? Because I thought it was a lotion and it's like a scrub. They lied to me in the store. This shit going back. Maybe not. But, and then I got this. Let's see what it looks like. Here is the pink bag you got. It just say Victoria's Secret. It just say Victoria's Secret right there at the bottom. $59 value. Man, please. Child, $59 worth. Okay, so that's everything right there. Good body polish, Victoria's Secret. Baby, come smell this. And it was on, it's only $6.99 right now. Let it sit in. Let it dry. At least the lotion, y'all. I gotta go back. Get my little sugar cone. It smells so good, though. You don't like it? <laughs> okay, y'all. Let's go run errands, guys. I'm wearing nothing but Jimmy Choo. I want you. Let's go. All right, guys, we're here. Remember what I told y'all about parking right by where you got to go. I'm here that fast, so let's go.
right guys, if you come, it is a limit. What you say, 24? Mm -hmm. So don't bring all your stuff, because it's a limit. So you say you can log it in and do what? We can log it in, and so next time you stop by, we can just uh, have these on call for you. I'll take them back. Thank you. Can you follow step with us? Yeah, I do. What's your phone number? 469. Yeah, that was just dumb to me, Mac. Mac always doing some dumb shit. And it's like, y'all used to be the top dog, but it's so many brands now. You should do whatever you need to do to keep people because people don't really be checking for Mac like that. So she gonna say she can log the rest of my stuff because this is what she couldn't take. She said she can log the rest of it so the next time I come back, I can get the free items. Why you just can't do it like another profile or something today so I don't got to come way back out here because it's not close to me. But she did say that you can back to Mac to Dillard's Macy's and stuff. But it's a limit now. So I'm right here at Dillard's. But the thing is, when you go to the Mac Pro Store, you can back to Mac for lipstick, lip gloss, or eyeshadow. Dillard's and stuff, you can only get a lipstick. I didn't want any lipsticks, but they're forcing me to get them. So let's go. Never in my life been in this Dillard's, so I don't even know what door to go in. Never. Because it's like one walking distance for me, so. Oh, well, geez, that's perfect. Because looky, looky. Right there is Mac. Be still. <laughs> they got a big store. Oh, sorry. Okay, so stop. Let me grab your all right guys, so they can't give you the box when you back to Mac. Like, how annoying, because I was going to gift these. <laughs> Woo, okay, where's Kurt? Y'all know who I'm looking for. Yeah, let me get up out of here because you know how I am. Y'all know I just got a Dillard's card and I'll be like, swipe, 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 and don't even need this stuff. They only have one Kurt Geiger on sale. I ain't like it. It's a rainbow one. But I got a rainbow one at home that still got the tag on it, so why buy another one? I'm, I love that silver bag, but it's $325. We're going to wait till that one go on sale or when Dillard send me a coupon. Hey, how are you? So, um, yeah i'm um, highly annoyed though because like i said she said that they have to take these lipsticks out the box when you back to mac and i was gonna put them you know guys know i'm in a wedding saturday it's now wednesday i was gonna put them in the gift bags for the women in the wedding what not my lip glosses these lipsticks and they kept the boxes so I don't know. They probably will still appreciate it. I'm going to just keep them. Because one time, my friend had some at work and asked me for some makeup. And you know how we get those PR boxes? Like, so our packaging be a little different than um, most people. And they told my best friend that the stuff was used because it didn't come in a box. So I had to go the fuck off. I'm like, no, I'm a, I'm a uh, beauty influencer. And sometimes our stuff come in promotional boxes, like a big box with the whole collection. So no, it's not individually boxed. Like girl, just give me my stuff back. Like girl, just give me my stuff back cause you real ungrateful. Like why would I send you some used stuff? Like my best friend Cotton was like, she saying I got all this stuff is used and something I was like, and I had to like send the pictures back of like on Smashbox or 
Lancome or Estee Lauder used to send me like these whole big boxes of the lipsticks in a circle but it was just the lipstick without it each individually box like this shit ain't used tell that ungrateful hoe bye I was mad mad because it was like a secret Santa and you only supposed to send like an item worth up to $20 and I sent like $300 worth of makeup and she was complaining Girl, give me all my stuff back and we'll go get you that one gloss you wanted. The one gloss you wanted in a box. <laughs> if that's but she never gave it back. So okay, let me show you the lip glasses I got. MAC lip glosses are called lip glass. I did all uh new. I was trying to get all glosses today. I'm a gloss girl now, so I got the cult favorites, which is Oyster Girl. Maybe I should wait till I get home. Yeah, I'll wait till I get home so you guys can see the true color anyway. So, I don't have any unboxings. My P.O. box didn't have anything. I got two more things to do. I have to go get a bigger size of this bra. I wish it was one in this small, but it's not. Yeah, I remember in a recent vlog, I was telling y'all, if it's not what you want, stop selling. selling. Just keep going till you get what you want. That's what I should have just did, because I ain't want no dang on lipsticks. I didn't. But I'm trying to be look out for other people. Like I could just gift them. When I could have just told them to put me on record or when I come back get four more glosses. It's over now. I just thought about it. I should have brought those lipsticks in with me. But I shouldn't be in here too long. Y'all yeah, know I'm just going to see what Kurt Geiger they got on sale. And we're literally right here at the door. So Did let's you know go. We offer on-site alterations. That's right. Cute. Our team of professional tailors can do mm -hmm. and I guess they don't have a section for him in here. You literally have to dig. God dang, Texas. Well, no. They gave me very much Ross vibes, but you guys know I love Ross, but I don't feel like digging today. So I wasn't finna dig. I don't need nothing no way. Let's take this raggedy ponytail back. Amazon wrong. Please look at the reviews and the pictures before y'all purchase stuff anywhere, any website. All right, guys, that literally took 30 seconds. Um, yeah, don't keep that stuff. You can take it back to Kohl's, the USPS store, Whole Foods. Just take it, scan it, and you done. And y'all remember that ponytail? Y'all remember that ponytail, that trick shoe I was telling y'all about last vlog? When she went to do the Amazon return. Hold on, I feel like my nose dirty. Oh, okay. When she went to do the Amazon return, they tell her don't even send it back. That's how you know people been scamming with that. It's Monet. I'm trying to see if it's anything. My stabilizer. I need a new one, y'all. I'm sorry. I'm trying to see if it's anything out this way I want to eat that we don't have since I'm out this way. <clears throat> I don't think it is, y'all. Last stop, I think. No, I kind of need to go back in bed and buy Victoria's Secret because y'all know last night I got that um scrub and I wanted the lotion. I'm going to see if somebody give me a gift card though. They don't have a 38H in store, guys, so I have to get beige. Womp womp. Child, I'm like, just let me go home. They won't even exchange the bra because I bought it online and I don't have the, the order number. Like, do y'all know how much I shop? If I kept all them receipts and confirmations my emails will be a mess i look but i literally can't find it y'all that very much got me because i'm a black lady because i ain't never in my life took nothing back to no store that still got the tags on it and they giving me a hard time like it still got the tags on it you notice your freaking product just exchange it for the size i need I'm having one of them days though, so I just got my bra and left. Then she gonna say, well, you can buy an extender. No, bitch, you can just exchange it for the size I need. Give my shit back. Give it back. All right, so here's T, sis. I'm thinking I should just take a nap and start over today. Cause clearly, ain't nothing working in my favor. I mean, absolutely nothing. So let me just show y'all the lipsticks I got. So, 
So this one right here is Velvet Teddy. It's a beautiful chocolate nude. That's Velvet Teddy right there. This one is Spirit. This one is Soar. And this last one is Booby Woo. Of course, you guys, I don't know what Booby Woo look like, right? So, I just got some brown nudes. And y'all know I wear red all the time. So, I just got a red lippy. Yeah, I need to take a nap. My energy has drained and everything. So, um, let's go with the lip glosses. They, I, all these lip glosses going straight in my makeup bag. Cause y'all know that's all I keep in my makeup bag and my purse because I apply my foundation where I don't have to keep retouching throughout the day. So all I put in there is um, lip products. So this is see-through. Of course, of course y'all probably can guess what I got. Oh baby. Spite. I love me some spite, y'all. And the last one is Oyster Girl. That's it. That's all, y'all. Morning. I know one of y'all sent me a, a new bunny, but I'm going to put it in my birthday house so I can't start wearing it to afterwards so I'll forget. Y'all know that's how I do things. I had to come over here and show y'all this every, <laughs> bro, like, bro, I get so many sponsorship requests and honestly, I only, a lot of people don't like to deal with hair companies, but I do because the hair companies I deal with, I know as soon as I drop the video, I'm going to get paid. I don't have to wait on no 45, net 45, net 75, and then I sell a hair and profit more, so that's just what I choose to do. But you guys know I do branch out occasionally, like, well, a lot. I just have an even balance. Um. So, with that being said... This is a request from SugarDaddyMe.com. Y'all, I am screaming because they said they found me on TikTok. So, it didn't go viral. But the video where I took my daddy to breakfast, it got a good amount of views. Not a lot, lot, but a good, good amount. And it's like, how did you confuse that? <laughs> like, bro, that is my birth daddy. Me and all my brother's daddy. My mama and daddy was married 37 years before she died, daddy. Not no damn sugar daddy. So, no, I don't want to collaborate. <laughs> like, as a PR firm, do people not check? They just instantly start requesting stuff like what happened with Zillow. Like, check your people before you contact them. Is there like a master list somewhere? Like, the shit is weird to me. And then on the flip side of that, it's a lot of new YouTubers coming up. Be careful who you share your address and stuff with. Somebody went blow for blow for me yesterday because they said she ain't approached them. And they was like big bragging, talking shit about it. And I was like, boo, make sure that she and it's a scam going off. And they snapped on me. I digress. You got it, boo. You get scammed, you get scammed. And then... Also, as a YouTuber, you need to know that, like, if you work with a company, a lot of people go have your address. So, have you ever been watching YouTube and somebody is showing a PR package and they're like, I have no idea how this company got my address. That's because if I work for a PR firm, there's a lot of companies under my umbrella, right? So, if I think I'm giving my contact information to Contour Me by Nikki, I'm actually giving it to Contour Me by Nikki, Platinum D, uh, Makeup by Platinum, because that one PR person or firm works for all those companies. On the flip side of that, that's why you have to be careful how you do your PR, because if you mess up 
showing one of them people packages and you like why this company because it's a it's a thing all youtubers review and stuff for the same companies that how many people you know is reviewing jbw watches at the same time and i'm not throwing shade because i'm one of them hello fresh at the same time so the point i'm trying to make is if you mess up with one of them and you're like, oh, I want to review for the other one. And you wonder why these people ain't contacting you. It's because you messed up with one of their other companies they work with. Yeah. This is a real life business. We grab the camera and y'all think we just having fun out here. But it gets stressful behind the scenes. It do.